Hello YouTube Kings Direct by here with yet another product review of the professionally refurbished Game Boy Colors. And no, you didn't hear me wrong. I said Game Boy Color. Uh, these are originally launched, I believe it's 1998, so almost 20 years ago. These are the antiques of video games. Along with, uh, it's up there along with the Ataris and the old Nintendo. So. Uh, with these units, it's been discontinued for a while now, so uh, it's kind of hard to find like brand new ones. And if you have a brand new one, uh, it's probably going to be like I will sell them for about three hundred bucks on on eBay if it's brand new seal. But uh, if you don't want to spend that kind of cash for these good old memories, or even just for collecting them, uh, there's these professionally fully refurbished ones. Uh, what I mean by professionally fully refurbished, it's um, everything, it's new except for the motherboard and uh, sometimes the screens, uh, depending on the, uh, in the condition of the screens. I actually found a company out here in China that, that, that specialized in refurbished um, video game systems and uh, they do a pretty good job of it, like I'll show you, like this one's the clear one. And uh, they don't have the serial number because uh, it's it's refurbished. So they have the sticker on the back. And then uh, everything's in functioning, uh, working order. And then let me give you a quick demonstration. Pop some uh, Energizer Bunny in there. I don't even know if they say Energizer Bunny anymore. It's been a while. All right. And then I have one of these uh, 108 in ones that I found in the market. So it, it, apparently it has 108 games in here. All right. And uh, with these ones, if you're unfamiliar with these, if you're young and never seen this, uh, back in the days when we were playing video games, it's all black and white. And this was like the, the PS Vita of the 90s. So it's the very first Game Boy that actually had color. Can you imagine like playing black and white games and also you see color? It's like a wow thing back then. And uh, with these ones, uh, some of the games from before, I think Contract was a black and white game. Uh, and then on the Game Boy Color, it will actually come out with color. Yes. Well, in, in, in like four or not a four, about 16 different shades. Like as you can see, it's still kind of black and white. But the, the guy there, it's actually in red. I'm not sure if you guys can really see. Like, this is what we used, used to play, but all in black and white. But this is like the first time we saw, wow, Contra in color. You know, this was awesome back then, right? But compared to, to a PSP or a PS Vita or PSV or a 3DS now, you're like, eh. But these are for all the retro fans and... Um, they also made games that was designed for uh, Game Boy Colors in full colors. Uh, I believe Mario DX was one. Uh, yes, this one. Mario DX. See, it's in full color. It's just like the old Nintendo version. Except now you have it in a handheld. So this was like a wow thing. Wow, I, I see green, you know. I see blue. It's the first time ever before the smartphone age, before the PSP and everything. So, uh, and and for these, as I as I mentioned earlier, it's been twenty years since these machines were made. So, uh, there might be some flaws on these, but not major flaws. Uh, with one of these, I found the volume. It's kind of glitchy, so it's it's kind of stuck. It's hard to change. But uh, that's the best they can do for, for the company because without uh, repairing the board. Because with these boards, once it's repaired, it's, uh, they, they, in China, they have a saying that it's uh, a, a, a second grade thing. So if, if anybody burns anything or solder anything, not burns, solder anything on the board, it's considered as a bad unit, then that's not cool. But with these, uh, I try my best to uh, do QC myself. I tested. I test out every single machine I sent before, and uh, I, I had complaints about my GBAs before about scratches. Like like this one, it has a light scratch here, but it's not a scratch. There is uh, actually a film on these that you can peel off. 
on the corner and once you peel that off this whole thing will be like mirror finish and right now it's kind of matte all right so uh there you have it uh the game boy colors and i do have them in uh, orange or sorry yellow not the uh, not the pikachu version but the yellow one the clear one the clear purple the original purple uh the blue and the green ones here for grabs so uh, if you like uh, this video, uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.